Hi, Chuck here from Sunshine Coast Native Bees. Just got a little video for you to have a look at, see what you think, see if it works, um, but it's a whole lot of fun doing it. So let's get into it right now. Question is, why am I mucking around with terracotta clay when I'm really into bees and stuff? The answer is, we're still in bees and making a native beehive or a solitary beehive and packing the middle of it out with terracotta clay because the one thing I know that these this terracotta clay um, native beehive will do is uh, attract blue banded bees so why not give it a go so I just made up a little hive a little box with an A-frame roof on it made it nice and watertight painted it with some uh, exterior paint um, yeah very twee it matches our house I know okay uh, we'll get over that um, but then once you load it up with clay you use a pencil just a normal pencil uh, this one here and I put a bit of tape on it um, to about uh, seven millimeters deep and uh, then you've got a guide all you're doing then is just going through and finding a spot make it nice and even or I make it nice and even maybe that's the ADD in me coming out and just push it in to that you use that as your guide all around your um, putting your holes in your damp clay so the clay is still very soft and easy to put holes into it makes it a very easy process to to set up so um, there's not much more to it than that I mean it's just a batter now of sit put it outside in a great spot you know I, I, I'll put it out near some of my other uh, native beehives and um, just keep an eye on it watch it I know that I've got in my garden I've already got lots of leaf cutter bees I know I've also got some firetail resin bees um, but I'd like to see some um, blue banded bees and just what else um, can be attracted to this side so it's, it's really a bit of fun so uh, anyway just thought I'd pass it on good bit of information um, simple easy thing to make up and uh, very happy with that so we'll put it out in the garden and we'll keep you up to date with what goes on with it 